While you're here, you shall rule all that lives and moves, and shall have the greatest rights among the deathless gods. Those who defraud you and do not appease your power with offerings, reverently performing rites, and paying fit gifts, shall be punished forevermore. I think that's just about it for today. Oh, I still need to get my ID photo taken. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, just send in a pre-existing photo. Huh? You don't like having your photo taken, right? It's fine, I hate being in pictures as well. And I don't understand why, since he's so handsome. Hmm. Hello, Minthi. I'm so glad I managed to track you down. Hmm. I wasn't able to make a reservation at the restaurant that we like for tonight. So I was thinking we could have dinner at your place. Hmm. Uh, he's such a good cook. Of course he'll never admit it, though. Mm. Has he made you anything before? Um, no. Oh, that's too bad. Mm. What are you doing? I think I might head off now, if that's okay. Y yeah. Just in a funk today. You know what? Let me tell you something about your brother. What is that supposed to mean? Maybe she just finds him annoying. He is pretty annoying. I know I shouldn't have yelled at her. You don't have to use that tone. I guess you're right, Retsuna. Uh. Uh, easy. Phew. I made this for you. I'm sorry I told you off. I realize some of our rules are a bit hypocritical. Hmm. I'm sorry too. I hate fighting with you. I just wanted you to know that I'm so grateful for you letting me stay in your home. 
I wouldn't even be allowed to leave the mortal realm if you hadn't stuck your neck out for me. And I'm sorry about your coat, too. I know you liked it. I didn't want you to get into trouble with Hestia, but it was like she'd already built up a store in her head before she got here. You know what? Hestia's kind of a jerk. <laughs> You're not wrong. Huh? Percy, what's wrong? Artemis, I haven't been completely honest with you. I might have... a tiny little itty bitty... crush on Hades. Thank you for joining me for the monthly meeting for the Goddesses of Eternal Maidenhood. I just wanted to kick things off by saying great work on our last fundraiser. It will go towards the upkeep of many temples in the mortal realm. Isn't this kind of a waste of time without Athena? Um... Athena would want us to run the meeting properly in her absence. And the next item on the agenda is... Reviewing a potential new member for us. New member? Hestia, why didn't you lead with that? It's Demeter's daughter, Kore. Kore, huh? I've never heard of her. Are we on schedule for this month? This shipment is set to arrive in the Olympus Space Factories next week. Everything is completely on track. Excellent. Just what I wanted to hear. Hello, little bean. Have you finished your studies? Mm hmm. My daughter is clever. Every week she gets faster and faster at her work. Good. 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 Uh, hold on. Ore, your last two answers are incorrect. Hmm. This is the third time this month. What's gotten into you lately? <sighs> Don't worry. I know you'll do better tomorrow. Mm. Well, this afternoon is yours. What would you like to do? <clears throat> may I visit the forest past the mountain? You may. <coughs> but, only if the flower nymphs go with you. Not the flower nymphs. I was kind of hoping I could go on my own. <sighs> you know exactly why that isn't a good idea. But I wouldn't go too far. Kore! We've had this argument too many times. Either you take the nymphs, or you can stay at home. not being able to walk alone in the forest. Now that Kore is old enough to wed, we are happy to induct her as an official goddess of eternal maidenhood. Mm -hmm. Oh, fantastic. Isn't that great news, sweetheart? Huh? We'd like to acknowledge Kore's commitment to excellence within her education. We've decided to award her with an academic scholarship. <laughs> Does that mean I, I could move to Olympus? Oh, sweetheart. I think it would be better if you just commute. 
But you said that if I- You could put it towards your homeschooling. Wouldn't that be fun? W what uh. <gasps> Let's take a photo for the blog! Oh, honey, you're going to be such a good role model for the other girls. Mm. They treat her like a show pony. Why can't they see that she's miserable? Mm. Don't look at me like that. I don't want to get involved. can't live with me in Olympus. If she wants to. <gasps> huh? R really? But you don't even know me. Uh. Artemis, what a wonderful gesture. You usually don't have this level of initiative. Excuse me? I'm so proud of you! Ah, stop! Now hold on one second! I think you're all getting ahead of yourselves. I haven't agreed to anything. Hmm. But Demeter, she clearly wants to live in the city. What's her problem? Artemis, I respect you. However, mm. you don't know the first thing about caring for a child. Newsflash, she's not a child. <clears throat> now, now, there's no need to raise our voices. This is stupid. Corey, how old are you? I'm 19. Ugh. 19 years old. Corey, do you want to live with me? Yes, please! I think we're done for today. I didn't come here to be told what's best for my daughter. Thank you for having us. <gasps> huh? I think she likes you. my babies. Which one should I use this evening? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a gorgon by the toe. Huh? Ah. Hermes, you scared the crap out of me. Artemis. What happened to your shirt? Huh? Uh oh. How can you not know? Uh, don't ask hard questions. Anyway, I've got a delivery for you. It's from Korai. Really? Dear Artemis, I hope this letter finds you well. I'm writing to ask if you would still be willing to let me live with you. I have my mother's approval. Sincerely yours, Persephone. Persephone? What's with the name change? Mm. Uh, I don't know. Uh, you know how it is. The mortals are always renaming us. It's kind of like how Hades' actual name is Adonius, but the mortals just refer to him as Hades. Yeah, but Persephone, that means bringer of death. This is weird. Demeter was flat out offended by the mere suggestion of this arrangement. And now it's fine? I'm confused. Do you know something? Hmm. Hermes! What you witnessed yesterday? You must never speak up to anyone. My daughter's reputation is my top priority. I know you care about my daughter. And I appreciate your willingness to fudge the records in your role of gathering souls. 
Deceiving Hades in this manner is no small task. But know this, if a single word of this gets out, and I mean a single word, and I found out you were the cause, Hermes, I'll be wanting this back, and then some. I don't know. I think she just realized Corey is getting too old to control. I should have been honest about it. It's been a lot to process. But it would be a lie if I said I didn't have feelings for him. Hmm. Say something, you're making me nervous. But <laughs> why? <B> why? <laughs> but well, objectively, don't you think he's kinda handsome? No, Persephone. I do not think Hades, the Unseen One, King of the Underworld, God of the Dead, is kinda handsome. Sometimes, when he smiles a certain way, you can see he has dimples. <coughs> Artemis? Demeter is going to kill me. What about TGOEM? What about your scholarship? Hmm? It's not like I'm planning on acting on it. That would be ridiculous. But wait. Come on, Artemis. You've never had feelings for someone before? Me? Nope, never. So you, Hestia, and Athena have never had feelings for anyone in the whole history of time? <coughs> nope. Well, that is the biggest fib I've ever heard. How did you get inside? Huh? <laughs> no door can stop me! Hmm. Okay, key under the doormat. I sensed an admission of a crush, and I came over as fast as I could. Where are you going? Someone just admitted that they have a crush, and I need to get involved. Oh! Fantastic. Carry on. So, you got a crush on big ol' Hades, huh? Hmm. I knew it. <gasps> Tell me all about it! Oh! I was planning on crushing all my feelings deep down inside and letting them wither over time. <gasps> wither over time? <laughs> but, but that's so boring! And also depressing. It's a fantasy that I've let myself linger in for a little too long. It doesn't matter that I feel like he was the first person to respect me, and not just because he was obligated to do so. Or that he smells like a forest fire in winter. Hmm? Going backwards from that is going to be very difficult, I think. And, and I convinced myself there was something between us, and that maybe he was mine. But clearly, I'm every bit the child everyone thinks I am, and I misread him. He's someone else's. <laughs> He's not mine at all. why they're called crushes. <laughs> that son of a bitch! I knew it! Zeus and his brothers are not to be trusted! Uh, 
<laughs> hey, where are you off to? I'm gonna key their cars. No, no wait. wait! Dang it. I don't think she's coming back. So, you said he's already someone else's. Who are you talking about? Minthy. She's his PA. <laughs> Minthy? Yes. Get the fuck out! That river nymph? Yeah. Are you sure? I, I saw it on that Fates book thingy. Well, I'll be damned. Do you know much about her? Oh, sweetie. They are the ultimate on-again, off-again dumpster fire. Mm. Last time I saw them together, they made such a spectacle. Stop acting like a brat and get out of the car! No! Mm. Baby... Please, get out of the car. I think I'd rather sit here and listen to the radio. Thanks, asshole. Why don't you just insult my dress some more? How many times do I have to apologize? Hmm. All I meant was that perhaps your outfit may not be entirely appropriate for a seven-year-old's birthday party! You could just tell they were meant to be. Why don't you pick all my outfits for me from now on? Oh, here we go! Man, they're really going at it. <laughs> I thought you told him not to bring her. Yeah, that doesn't really make me feel any better. I have to go to work and see them together all the time! I can't believe I thought he liked me! Aww. Well, I wouldn't say it's all in your head. But it is, though! <sighs> it's not really my place to say this, but you clearly need a win right now. You know that prank we played on you at the party? Y yeah. The real reason my mother was pissed with you? is because Hades took one look at you from afar, and said, Huh? Honestly, I think she puts Aphrodite to shame! So, at the very least, you know he finds you... aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> what? What?! Oh! He tried to tell me earlier, but, but I thought he was joking. I... I said something about you putting Aphrodite to shame or whatever. Oh no! I laughed in his face! I'm sure it's fine. Hey, so, uh... I don't mean to pry. But a prerequisite to being a member of TGOEM was being a virgin. Last time we talked, you were one. Not anymore. Mm. So, what happened? <gasps> I knew it. Did you enjoy yourself? <sighs> oh, I, I am so excited for you. Can tell? D do you do you think anyone else can tell? Uh, only my mother and I. We can control the sexual desires of anyone who isn't a virgin. Hmm. Uh, don't worry. Hera banned us from using those powers on other gods. Uh, after Zeus blamed us for his affairs. 
need to have a talk. So, was it Hades? How was it? I need some details, please. <sighs> Persephone? <sighs> hey. <sighs> hey. Eros, I, I messed up. It was Apollo. Apollo? <sighs> are, are you kidding? I wish! Why are you crying? Persephone? I... I... Just, just show me. Listen, nobody should be able to come into your bedroom, wake you up, and... I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just... I'm really upset for you. You don't get to just nag someone into having sex with you. Th th that's not how consent works. <laughs> you didn't mess up. Apollo did. You really think so? I know so. Come on, let's get out of here. We could go to my house. I don't know. I don't really remember a lot about what happened. I don't know how to talk about it because I feel like my facts aren't... real? Everything is blurred together. Yeah, it's, uh, it's because your brain is trying to store the memory somewhere else until you're ready to deal with it. It's normal. I still don't know why I agreed to it. He was just really intimidating. I'm not sure if I even want to be in TGOEM. I know it sounds weird, but in the moment, it seemed like the only way out. I'm so frustrated with myself because part of me is so mad with him for leaving straight after. It's okay to have complicated feelings about it. Be kind to yourself. I'm glad you told me. It's, it's nice to be trusted. <sighs> I should be able to deal with this on my own. Persephone, being a functional adult doesn't mean dealing with everything by yourself. It's okay to go get help. You promise you won't tell anyone? A real promise? I don't know, Persephone. He shouldn't be able to get away with this. Hmm. You should tell Zeus. You should tell a lot of people. And you should tell Artemis. How can I, though? I'm just not up to it. Sorry, I don't want to push you to do things you're not comfortable doing. Let's make a deal. I promise not to tell anyone, but you need to see a therapist. You need to take care of your brain. You can see my therapist. They're great. When you're ready, I'll be right here. <laughs> have overslept. It's really warm today. It's been a long time since I slept all night. It turns out Poseidon doesn't have a car. Unrelated, I adopted this wolf. 
Hey, um, can we talk soon? Delete. Hades! The baklava was good. I regret sharing the majority of my portion with Hermes. <laughs> Sent at 4 a.m.? Hmm. If you play your cards right, maybe I'll make you some more. <laughs> Let's hope I'm better at cards than I am at chess. <laughs> Are you my brother's girlfriend? I what? I'm not flirting with my boss! Oh! You scared me! No, I'm just his friend. Oh, do you want to see my hamster? Storgy, leave Persephone alone. Come at breakfast. Oh, you should have kicked my lazy butt out of bed. I could have helped. It's fine. You were pretty out of it. You wake her up. I want her to see my hamster. Nobody wants to see your dumb hamster. <laughs> Shut up! These are my younger siblings. Mania? Pragma? Philautia? Ludus? Philia? Agape? And Storgy. Little monsters, this is Persephone. Say hello. Nice to meet you. So, you don't have a Facebook account? Hmm? Oh, no. I feel like it might be a little complicated for me. Philia has no problem running her Facebook, and she's seven. I don't think that's really necessary. Phone, please. I... How are you meant to stalk your crush if you don't <gasps> have an online presence? Ah, Eros. <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> News of romance travels fast in this home. What's your email? Um. Oh, Persephone at underworld.com. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Done. Now you just need a photo of yourself for your account. Oh, um, okay. Don't look into the camera. Mm -hmm. Look out the window or something. And squish your boobs together. Amateurs everywhere, I swear. She's not wrong. Good, good. Now you need some friends. Hades? No! Rookie mistake! No, 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 you want Hades to friend request you. How do I do that? Let's add Hera. There, she's accepted your request. Clearly, our overlord is very busy today. And posted! What's that gonna do? They're mutuals. So he'll see it. Mutuals? You're killing me! Hmm. I'm home, everybody! Hmm. <gasps> Mommy! <laughs> I thought this was your house! Uh, this is kind of my mom's house. It's you. 
you. <laughs> you have a lovely home, ma'am. And your whole family has been very welcoming. Hi, Mama Bear. <laughs> Hope you don't mind I brought company over. Give me those. You're probably doing it wrong. Let me help you. Go get some shut eye. Ampolis, can you please draw for me? Let her get some sleep. She's been putting up with my nonsense all night. No, I can do one drawing. It's fine. Just one, okay? <laughs> Did you see him? Hmm. No, I couldn't find him. You know you shouldn't go looking for him. It just stresses you out. Hmm. It's been four months now. I know, but still. Hmm. What if he's hurt, though? Ah, oh, but Ma, he gets hurt all the time, and everything always works out. Coffee? Hmm. You! You're bringing down the vibe with your mopey face! So, what's up your ass? Ma, be nice! Someone step in your flower patch? No, ma'am. Stop calling me, ma'am. No one likes a suck up. You love it when people suck up to you! Y yes, ma'am! I, I mean, yes! Oh, relax! <laughs> Let me guess. Hmm. You have a crush, and now he's dating someone else. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> nope! You're transparent as all get out. Now, I wonder who it could be. Hmm. It's Hades. It's not Hades! You've been in town, what, one week? Two weeks, Top? He's like the only man you know! He is not the only man I know! I know... I know but tons of men! <laughs> hmm. Fine! It's Hades! She told me she was planning on crushing all our feelings down until they wither and die! Eros! But that's so boring and depressing! That's what I said! What's the problem? Why don't you just seduce him? <sighs> oh! Ma! Ma! I just had a brainwave! She could wear a long, mysterious coat with nothing underneath. And then, she should go to his office after hours. And then... She I better get going! Thank you for having me! Sit your ass down. I'm not done yet. Nymphs do not take gods from us! Uh, but how do you know about Minthi? Letting that nymph take something that you want is an embarrassment to our kind! So sorry! Stop being so passive! It's annoying! Now get out! Uh, well, since you're leaving, I'll come with you. And don't tell anyone I was nice to you. Wait, you were being nice to me? <laughs> Why does everyone keep saying that? So, is she gonna beat me up if I don't go to work half naked? Maybe? But, uh, don't worry, she has a short attention span. Mm. Hey, I just wanted to say thank you. I didn't really do anything. I just happened to be the pinnacle of emotional intelligence. Really, uh, I should be thanking you. Why's that? Spending time with you has made me realize that I, too, have been pushing my feelings deep down and letting them wither. It's time. It's time to find Psyche.
it's time to find Psyche. Hopefully she can forgive me after everything that's happened. Wait! Please! Please! Just stop! Boss, there's been a significant influx of souls today. It's mayhem on the beach. What? This is way off the projected forecast. Hmm. Ahoy, hoy. <laughs> what? Can you bring up the mortal realm feed? Let's get to the bottom of this. <laughs> Hold the phone! Is that Eros? Deal with that, would ya? Mm -hmm. Bring him back here once you're done. Dude, you're gonna get in trouble! <clears throat> this is bullshit! <clears throat> Arrows! Um... Where is my son? Rose, what happened? I'm sorry, Ma. I, I don't know what came over me. Zeus is ready to see you now. Mm. Would someone please tell me what's going on? Well, it would seem Eros has a little bit more of his father's spirit than we thought. He killed 300 mortals this morning, and he doesn't have a permit for such an act of wrath. Big deal. You know we can make more mortals. Artemis and Apollo did something similar a while ago, and I don't recall them getting reprimanded. Playing favorites as usual? Why am I not surprised? Aphrodite, he's been harboring a mortal in the city without a permit. I believe you are already familiar with Psyche. <sighs> now, <clears throat> let's discuss your punishment. Punishment? You're kidding. Yeah, well, he punched poor Hermes in the face, too. <clears throat> Surely you and I can come to sort of agreement? <laughs> I'm sure we could work something out. Ma. Just shut up and go wait out in the car. Why don't you go chat with Prometheus about Zeus's punishment? So? 
are you going to tell me where she is? So that's why you moved out. This is why I'm paying for your apartment? Why you've been avoiding me. Lying to me. I always let you do what you want. Be what you want. Spend time with who you want. And this is how you treat me. You've been shacking up with Psyche this whole time. It's hard to explain. Try me! I love her, but... She tried to kill me. <gasps> Don't make me go back. Where? The apartment. I, I, I can't face her. It, it, it hurts too much. I didn't know heartbreak could hurt this much. Is this how mortals feel when we play our games with them? Can I move back home? Of course. I'm going to do with this for you, but you have to help me out no matter what I ask, okay? I mean it. You jump? How high? Got it. Look at this credit card bill. Why the hell do they need a bread maker? Hello? Maybe she fell off the island and died? Good riddance. This must be his room. This place is a mess. Lazy son. I can't believe this. He didn't even make the bed. <laughs> there you are. Wake up! Oh! You're very beautiful. Well, duh. I am the goddess of beauty. And you're the mortal who broke my poor son's heart. Is he coming back? No. He doesn't want to see you. You know, since you tried to stab him. Oh. I should leave you here to starve. I wish you would. <laughs> You have one minute to plead your case. But, but it's a long story. Paraphrase. I was engaged to a really old man of my father's choosing. Eros brought me here to escape. But hid his identity from me. Nothing was adding up, and my sisters convinced me he was an evil wizard. So I tried to stab him, but it turned out he's a god. Then he got really mad and left. Hmm. What a mess. Are you okay? Shut up! Can't you see? I'm trying to think. Huh? 
Is this how mortals feel when we play our games with them? My son is an idiot. But you're the person that changed him. He was never meant to have a broken heart. I think this calls for a strange and elaborate punishment. Are, are, are you going to kill me? <laughs> Not today. You and I are going to do a little experiment. Huh? I want to know how much my son really loves you. Previously on Lore Olympus. What was that? What? The way you were before with Persephone. You know that was completely unnecessary. Hmm. Ah, oh, you're jealous, aren't you? Hmm? You two were gone for a long time. We ran into some trouble on the beach. Do you want her? I want you. So, um, <clears throat> do you still want to come over for dinner later? Y yeah, of course! Eight o'clock? Okay. After work drinks? Hmm, it's only 5 p.m. I should be done before 8. Hello. Okay, okay. Today didn't go according to plan at all. What in Olympus happened to keeping my distance? Pushing her away is a hell of a lot harder than I thought it would be. That little minx. <laughs> Does she even know she's torturing me? Probably not, because she's a well-adjusted individual. Unlike myself. Nobody's ever made something like this for me before. It feels wrong to throw it away. It feels wrong to eat it. Hey, Deadpool. Did you want me to pick you up later? Guess I better get ready. Would you give it a rest? Can't I have a moment to myself, Cerberus? Guess she's fine to get herself here. <laughs> you guys wouldn't like onion, I promise. Just a little late. Hey, did I get the time for this wrong? If you don't want to come anymore, it's fine. Just let me know.
I've spent entire lifetimes outrunning that deep feeling of loneliness. However, tonight it's completely inescapable. Of course she doesn't want to be around you. You're just like me. How long was I asleep? My head hurts. Well, that explains a lot. Hmm? Hmm? If you get to break the rules by standing on the countertop, then I get to break the rules too. Hmm. Previously on Lore Olympus. I want you to have this. Romance aside though, don't be afraid to get to know her. You might be surprised. I'm not sure if that's a good idea. I'm going to eat this baklava, and then I'm going to read this letter that isn't addressed to me. Of course it's perfectly delicious! Mm, lousy Hermes. Dear Hecate. Hmm? How is everything? I'm sorry you had to cut your visit with us short. I miss your company very much. Mm. I'm so sorry Mother was mad about your surprise guest. She just doesn't want men on the property because of me. I hope the King of the Underworld didn't have too nasty of a hangover. What? 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 Men on the property? King of the Underworld? That's me! That's me! Does this mean we met before the party? But I don't remember! Somehow this is your fault. Hecate must know something. Mm. Oh. What is your crisis, Hades? Because you must be having a crisis. Only someone with a crisis would make a phone call at 3.45 a.m. If you didn't have a crisis, that would be very selfish. I, I hope the king, king of, of the, the underworld, underworld didn't, didn't have, have too nasty of a hangover. hangover. Love, Corey. Ah, uh, so you read the letter after all. How interesting for you. I'm hanging up now. Wait, wait, wait! Oh, have you been drinking? Not in the last five minutes. How did your dinner go? Hmm. She didn't come. I see. Can you explain this letter, please? This can't wait until a reasonable hour. Ugh. Of course it can't. Remember how I took a couple of months off last year to study poisonous plants? And I stayed with Demeter and Persephone in the mortal realm? You'd be amazed at what can be achieved with Deadly Nightshade. Yeah, plans. Super interesting. Get to the Persephone part. Hmm. <laughs> 
So sorry. One night, you came to visit me out of the blue. <laughs> you were very, very drunk. Demeter was not happy. The two of us had to take you back to the underworld that night. I don't remember. Why didn't you say anything? I didn't want to embarrass you. Your ego is very delicate. That doesn't explain the Persephone part. We tried to make sure no one knew that you were on the property. Especially Persephone. Guess she must have snuck a peek? You mean you don't know? Why didn't you ask? This may come as a major shock to you, Hades, but my life doesn't revolve around you. Just ask her. <sighs> but all I have is this letter to go off of. She'll think I'm creepy. Why don't you ask the fates the next time you're at work? They should be able to fill in the blanks. But... Bye! Hmm? So, we've met before. Which makes me wonder... What else is she hiding? After work drinks? Drinks sound good. Hades is making me dinner at 8, so I'll have to leave a little early. Sigh. Zeus went home and he didn't even tell me. Hmm. Hmm. Old Caro. Gods! Ahoy, hoy. Oh, hey, it's me. How many times have I told you do not call me at home? Hmm. There you are. Are you ready to go? Minthy, hey. <laughs> oh, look at your coat. It's so cute how you dress for comfort over style. Aw, I like your outfit. It almost covers your ass. <laughs> Shall we? Let's. I hate to be a bother, but it's my friend's birthday today. So please keep the drinks coming. Sure thing, Thetis. Anything for you. But, like, don't mention it's her birthday. Uh, she's, um, super embarrassed because of her age. Yeah, totally embarrassed. You need to get me all caught up. You've been busy. Hmm. I guess. So, Hades, you two are official now. Well, I guess I overreacted over Persephone. I had this embarrassing meltdown. Hades was really good about it. I just had to admit that Persephone set me off, and that I cared for him more than I realized. I thought he would be frustrated, but he was really keen about us trying a closed relationship. Zeus <laughs> would never do that for me. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Oh, for making such a serious commitment. <laughs> also, I just love how secure you are now. Why, I'd be green with envy over that Persephone. Oh, so 
such good breeding. And her ears are so little and cute. Would you ever consider having work done? <gasps> oh, he offered me a ride. But wait! <gasps> uh, d d tell me more about the Persephone situation. Hades told me I didn't need to be jealous. She is part of the goddesses of eternal maidenhood. <laughs> you idiot! Do you think a single one of those goddesses commits to a ridiculous chastity vow? Maybe Artemis does, but she's the dumbest meathead I've ever met. Let me ask you something. Sure. Does this Persephone suddenly have a reason to be around Hades? <gasps> um, she did start an internship in the underworld. <gasps> I knew it! Oh, you're so lucky you've got me! The Underworld Olympus internship exchange isn't supposed to start for another couple of months! We haven't even picked a candidate from Olympus yet. Clearly, Hades set things up so they can be in close proximity. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. <gasps> oh no! <gasps> what should I do? Good friend, do not text him back. But y you told me my tree to mean keep him keen approach it was stupid. Honey, no. It totally works for you. Trust me, he needs to be punished. <gasps> he, he did spend a lot of time with her this afternoon. See? Completely necessary. Don't worry, relax. Have another drink. I don't want to come anymore, wrong. it's fine. Just let me know. Oh, crap! I get all these messages. Morning, sleepyhead. You got so wasted last night, I had to bring you back to my place. But my date! Whoopi, you really need to get on top of your drinking, huh? I'm just gonna call him, okay? Good luck! I hope he's not mad. Flying sure is hard work. Luckily, it's a nice day for walking. Mm. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Sugar snaps, it's just Hermes. So it would be completely natural if I called Hades on the telephone, right? There is nothing in the rules that say I can't talk to him. It's just talking. Nothing sneaky about talking. Here goes nothing! What is it now? Shit, shit, shit! <laughs> Don't drink that! Huh? Hey, <laughs> hello! Oh no! My nerves are amplified because I admitted that I like him! Persephone? Is this a butt dial? What's a butt dial? It's a modern colloquialism for calling someone by mistake.
excuse me real fast. I'm just getting another call. Don't go anywhere. I won't. Salutations. Hades here. I'm indisposed. You know what to do. <laughs> hey, I'm back. You're not scheduled for work today, so you can't be calling in sick. What can I do for you? It's just, um, you messaged me at four in the morning? You idiot! Oh no, I can't believe I didn't consider the time when I messaged her. She probably thinks I'm a huge loser. She's calling to tell me she doesn't want to come here anymore. Maybe Zeus paid her to be nice to me all this time. Listen, Co uh, Persephone, I'm sorry. Are you alright? What? 4 a.m. is a very late time to be up. Or, um, early. And I wanted to know if you were alright. Me? Yes, you. Who else? Well, I'm just, uh, really, really talented at insomnia. You have trouble sleeping? Sleeping is overrated. I know, it's kinda weird. It's not that weird. I've always struggled with sleeping too. So, yeah. I can't even begin to imagine what someone such as yourself would have to lose sleep over. <laughs> But somehow, I'm not surprised. I suppose that's condescending. Deeply. Do you have class today? I actually don't. Somehow, I managed to score a three-day weekend. <laughs> ah, man, I've heard of those. You should try it sometime. I think it would suit you. Hmm. Anywho, I better let you go. Please don't. G goodbye. Goodbye. I know I'm going to let everyone down. But I need to get out of the goddesses of eternal maidenhood. I have to start planning an exit strategy. Retsuna? Retsuna, you're not being very helpful. The only plan I've got so far is to run away and join the Norse Pantheon. <coughs> so that's less than ideal. What a mess. I feel like a fraud for using my scholarship. I simply don't meet the criteria anymore. If I come out with what happened, I'll lose my scholarship for sure. And I certainly won't be able to live here anymore. But I want to go to school! I love school! Why should I give up something that I worked so hard for? I feel so guilty about using the money. Hmm. Huh? <gasps> but maybe I could pay them back! Look, Retsuna, I could pay for my internship. <laughs> Hades? <laughs> what is this? Well, that looks like a sheet of paper. Don't get cute. Interns aren't meant to receive income, and you know that. But Persephone is a guest in my realm. What would everyone say if she works here and I send her off with nothing? It would be shameful. And she is a beautiful lady who needs money to do beautiful lady things. Right. Don't let HR hear you say that. The internship runs for six months. And the scholarship is 15,000 drachma. If I'm really careful of my saving, I could pay the scholarship back. I know it doesn't fix everything, 
but it's a start. Oh, look! M maybe if I work really, really hard, Hades might give me a job. If I had a job, then I would have my own money. I could get my own place. And I could do whatever I wanted. I could get my ears pierced. Even go on a date. Uh. Maybe that's a touch ambitious. Hello, I need a memory from the records, please. Hmm. I said I need a memory- Yeah, I heard you, young blood. You know, beings usually come here to find out about their future. Son of Kronos, you've always been an odd one. Why do you need this memory? Hmm. <laughs> Isn't it obvious? The king has lost a valuable memory to wine. And this memory involves a young lady. <laughs> Look, I just want to know what I did and how embarrassing it was. Do you have the paperwork? Well, I was kind of hoping you'd do me a solid since I'm king. I need signed consent from Kore. After all, it's her memory too. But... Zeus would be in here every day otherwise. Touché. I think we can make an exception for Adonius. Hmm. But sister! Now, now. Adonius doesn't annoy us often. He doesn't have his brother's voyeuristic spirit. Surely he's earned a pass. Perhaps he could bring us some of that wine? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm? I guess that's settled. We will get back to you when it's ready, okay? Hmm. I was kind of hoping to have it now. Ugh. Don't push your luck, young blood. The case is, come sit with us. <sighs> Are you still cross with me? Also, I don't understand why you're breaking our rules for him. Ah, sister. It is natural for a king to be curious about his future queen. Get a lot of this. Oh my gods. <laughs> she looks terrible. It's going to be one of those days. Voicemail. Dinner was my idea. He always sulks like this. I stood him up. It's his fault for expecting so much from me. I had every opportunity in the world to make this work. Was he with her? Face it, I messed up. I, I just need to find him. What are you wearing? Shut up! 
Oh no. She's really mad. I have thousands of employees. Why couldn't one walk by right now? Huh? I don't want to be alone with her when she's like this. Minthy, shouldn't I be the one that gets to be mad? What happened? It's not my fault. I had a few too many drinks with Thetis. I, I don't get it. The date was your idea. And then you go drinking with Thetis. I already said it's not my fault. I had too many drinks by mistake. Every time you drink with Thetis, she gets under your skin and you drink too much. Minthy, she's not your friend. An afternoon with Miss Goody Two-Shoes and you're suddenly an expert on behavior? Hmm. You're lucky I even consider you! I know, I, I'm... I'm sorry. Wanna know why? I don't know why I'm like this. You're the spitting image of Kronos! <sighs> you have his eyes! His hands! His skin! to be with someone who resembles the greatest tyrant we've ever known. <laughs> Enough. Go home. But... You're suspended until further notice. But... Wait, I... I just wanted to talk to him. <laughs> I need... I need to apologize. Not today. Oh, my apologies. I'm sorry for interrupting you. <laughs> oh, stop. You're going to give me a big head. Why am I here? I believe you're having a traumatic break. Apparently, complete darkness is preferable to facing your feelings. Hmm. Aww. Look at your knotted brow. You used to make that same face when you were small. Hmm. I was so jealous of Rhea when you were born. I'd never seen a child with so many worries. Adorable. Thanks. I had half a mind to steal you for myself. Interesting. You better get back. That little golden traitor is here to see you. You're awake. Uh, Hera? Surprise! What are you doing here? Hecate told me what happened. Great, so everyone knows! My confidence is at an all-time high. I could turn her into a hideous beast with rotting flesh if you wished it. I don't. Drink? No thanks, I'm trying to cut back. 
Okay, so just a little baby serving for you. Hera, what are you doing here? Mm hmm? I'm here to comfort you in your hour of need, of course. You? Caring? <laughs> That's a good one. Don't laugh. I can be caring if I want. Last time I saw you, you were more than just a little bit angry with me. If you're hoping for an apology, this is as close as you're going to get. Hmm. <sighs> Please, don't hate her. Give me one reason why I shouldn't. Because I love her, and you should respect my wishes. I don't want to be alone anymore. You, Zeus, and everyone else assured me there wouldn't be a stigma with this role. But there is. Mm. Zeus told me you almost proposed to that nymph. You didn't come to me first! I knew you wouldn't go for it. Besides, since when were you interested in helping me get hitched? <laughs> I didn't know you wanted to get married. Yes. Yes, you did. You just don't want to admit that no goddess in her right mind would want to be queen here. I remind you of the limits in your power as a marriage goddess. Mm. And if you can't help me, don't judge me for my choices. Hmm. Hera. Yes? Do you think I look like my father? Is that what she said? Come here. Oh. Don't be like that. Come here. Hmm. Only a dullard who doesn't understand what they're looking at would say such a thing. Hera! My girl, come over here. Yes, Midas? Can you please go help Adonius with his bandages? Mm hmm? Hera, I know his injuries may be frightening. But you can't avoid him forever. Mm -hmm. A war is starting soon. You need to learn to be brave. But Mama... Hera, wouldn't you want someone to help you if you were injured? Yes. Go on. You need to set a good example for your sisters. Don't be frightened. It's only blood. Hello? Oh, good. You're awake. My name is Hera. Are you feeling better today? Mm hmm I'm here to help you with this. <laughs> Sorry! Mm. Zeus told me you were alone for 13 years. Is that true? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I was told you were struggling with speech. I forgot. That's a long time to be alone. I always need to have someone around. I can't be away from my sisters for too long. Huh?
Wait, wait, wait! Hmm? Have you completely lost it? I thought we agreed to stop doing that back in the 80s. I was feeling nostalgic. Sue me. Do you want Zeus to banish me somewhere further away than the Underworld? Hmm. Mm. Zeus and I have been fighting a lot. Hmm. <sighs> well, today is garbage. Do you want to get out of here? This is you. What? If I'd known you were taking me home, I would have refused. Will you at least come in? I don't think that's a great idea. Oh, settle down. I'm not trying to sleep with you. Hebe misses you. Are you trying to guilt trip me with your children? Oh, absolutely. Hebe, I've brought you a present. In a second, Mama. I'm very busy. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're gonna like it. Okay, I'm coming. Yes, I do. It's been three months! Hmm? Hi, Hera! <laughs> huh? Oh, sugar snaps. Oh! I, um... Persephone, what a nice surprise. Oh, I I'm sorry, I can come back later if you're busy. Oh, don't be silly, come in, come in. What brings you by this evening? I have some rose clippings I thought you might like for your garden. How thoughtful, you must stay for dinner. <coughs> oh, um, I'm not really dressed for it. It doesn't matter that you came to my home dressed in servants' rags. You look beautiful. I mean, I wouldn't say the rags. Hades, tell her she looks beautiful. <laughs> you look beautiful. Mm. Yeah, you're staying too. Mm -mm. I'm so sorry, Persephone. I completely forgot you were vegetarian. Oh, it's totally fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> this looks very filling. Vegetarian, huh? It's kind of a waste of time, don't you think? Hmm. <laughs> Ow! Hmm. <laughs> You know, Hera, I think you should consider hiring another assistant. I already told you I don't want another assistant. If I wanted someone utterly incompetent to traipse around me all day, I'd bring you to work with me. I'm only trying to help. <laughs> you seem frazzled lately. Hmm? Oh, I seem frazzled? Hmm? <laughs> Perhaps you should try being less annoying. Oh, give me a break. It wouldn't kill you to be a little nicer. <laughs> <laughs> Would you drop it? I'm trying to eat my oh dinner. Oh my goodness. That was so delicious. I could not eat another bite. 
How about I sort out those rose cuttings for you? Huh? Oh, really? Right now? Well, I am in my gardening clothes. And the sooner I'm done, the sooner you can enjoy them. All right, little dove, you're excused. Come in if you get cold, though. Will do, thanks. <sighs> I'm just gonna take a call outside. <laughs> Be careful, grass stains are a nightmare to remove. Wink! <laughs> Tap him! What if he doesn't come? <laughs> what if he does come? There's still time for me to escape over the fence! Ex uh, excuse me? <sighs> Why did I let my horniness give me a full sense of confidence? Hello. Hi. Can I sit here? I just need to send a few emails. Sure, I don't mind at all. Hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> huh. Why do you just... Why do I just... what? Why don't you just use your powers for, uh, well, this? I don't get it. Surely a job like this would take you all of two seconds. It's a little weird, I guess. Sometimes I like to do things the way the mortals do. I guess you could say I want to understand them. But why? Their lives are so short, and nothing seems to come easily for them. I... I just... I guess I don't want to lose my empathy for them. Using my hands helps me hold on to that. Mm -hmm. I still don't get it. <sighs> but I can try to. Man, I'm beat. Can you please give me a ride home? Can you see them? Yeah, almost. Give me a sec. What are they saying? I can't tell. I thought you could read lips. I never said I could read lips! Yep, it's just as I thought. She's totally coming on to him! What? Let me see. <laughs> yes! Mama! Papa! Hmm? What are you doing? Are you... lurking? Uh, um... Perverts! <gasps> oh! <gasps> Are you okay? Yeah, just tired. I wasn't expecting the evening to play out like this. <sighs> oh God! Sorry, I wasn't thinking. Old habits die hard. Stupid village girl. Please don't be embarrassed. It's fine, really. Persephone... 
There's nothing wrong with being raised in one of our motherland's great regions. Never apologize for being Sicilian. You probably can't imagine it. But I was actually born there. But really? <laughs> mm-hmm. The world was brand new, so we didn't call it Sicily at the time, but yeah. What did you call it then? Hmm. <laughs> Home. I have to give you something. I... Settle down, or not at work. You can't deny my gift. Hmm. seen one of these in a long time. Huh. What do you think? You look sufficient. <laughs> Adopus Kimi. Adopus Kisi. Stop canoodling in my wife's garden and go home! Uh. Hmm. Zeus and Hera fight a lot. Is that normal? Yeah, I guess. I'm embarrassed to admit that I don't notice it anymore. I know I shouldn't be surprised because it's old news. I thought being with someone meant looking out for each other. Maybe I'm just being naive. Trying to comprehend Zeus and Hera's relationship will give you a headache. I wouldn't recommend it. Joking aside, being optimistic doesn't make you naive. You see things not for what they are, but for what they could be. And I value that about you, Persephone.